morning guys, it's October 23rd, 2020. So here I got a call from a lady, she wants me to go do a, a server, gas furnace. Um, she wants me to go there and service it. So I don't think it's been cleaned in a while. Or I don't think I've ever worked for this lady before, so I'll go over there and check the burners and maybe you know, do a combustion test on it and make sure it's safe to run. She did say it was a furnace. Usually people don't know the difference between a furnace and a boiler. A furnace doesn't have any water in it. It just blows hot air. A boiler has water in it and it has radiators. That's the difference between a boiler and a furnace. Most people don't know that. If you don't know, now you know. We'll try to get you some shots when I get there. Molly's enjoying having the truck back, huh? Enjoy having the truck back. It's a good one. High efficiency. Has it been running okay? He makes a lot of noise the time he starts. He makes a lot of noise? Yeah, he makes, no, not a lot, a little bit noise the time he starts. How old is it? Ah, about, the time I bought it, the house would be about 25 years old. Flame sense is really dirty. Getting it out is going to be a problem though. It's way in there. I could probably take that burner out of there maybe and clean it. What a flipping job. Shitty, uh, shitty area to have it, you know? I had to take the, I had to take the cover off. It was way in the back there. Not easy. This is never, you never had this thing cleaned before? I, uh, the last service is about three years ago, but I don't know to do it. Where's the, the person we do it? And you said it's, it makes a lot of noise when it starts up? Yeah, it makes a little bit noise. Just when it starts? Yeah. Could be that the squirrel cage fan starting to go. Let me get that back in there. What a flipping joke. See if I get that screw back in there. Not easy. Go ahead and start it up. Go ahead and turn up the thermostat. Uh, go turn it up. I go turn it up. I'm, uh, I'm turn, actually... turn it up so it runs. Turn it up to 90. 90? Yeah, so it runs. That makes noise when it runs, so we'll see. I'm probably going to do a combustion test on it outside. It's right outside there. See what it's running like.
I'm gonna have to put the cover back on if I'm gonna do a test on it. Oh, she says it's making a noise when it stops. Probably the fan. She's a crusty one, Mr. Grinch. I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna go to get natural gas. Got the flame sensor back in there. What a bitch. Sounds like he shut it off. Sounds like he shut it off. Is that the noise you're hearing when it starts right there? Excuse me? What noise are you hearing when it starts? Oh, I just like noise around just like oh. Like that right there? No, 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 no. Different noise. Jan, stop, Jasmine. Stop. The fan hasn't kicked in yet, but check the combustion outside. Pressure maybe a little bit. Let's see. Boy, you got it. It's just shut off. What happened? Where did you turn the thermostat at? I, I, I'll be honest to you. I don't know too much about this. Oh, you didn't turn the thermostat up. Let me see. You want to go see? Yeah, it? let me do, see. Do it by yourself. That's okay. Oh, you this is very friendly. You okay? Oh. Yeah. Oh, I got it on 90. Heat on. I wonder why it shut off. Thing shut off. Unless the fan's not working. Yeah. It's off on limit. High limit, maybe. Thing shut off. It's off on high limit, so the fan's not working. Have you changed the filter in here? Yes. Okay, the, fan, the fan's not blowing. The last guy you come in service, you, you, you leave them on the parts behind. You see that small box right in the top? No, that's for the that's that's a that's a capacitor for the. The person that leave them behind. I don't know. It's a capacitor. Yeah, the motor's red hot. The motor's red hot. Unless it's, unless it's a, unless it's a uh, capacitor's bad, maybe. Let's hope. Got a bad motor here. Got a bad fan motor. Your fan's not spinning. Go forward to see what we're at here. Yeah, 
Yeah, it looks like you might have a bad capacitor there. Maybe. Maybe. Hold is kind of hot. It's not a good thing. Should be a ten. Must be a ten. Let's get. Let's put a ten in there. See if it works. I'm gonna ten here. We'll see what that one looks like. Yeah. The other one was faulty for sure. This one's definitely a 10, 10 5, so this one's working good. That's good. Hopefully, the fan kicks in. Kind of hot, it might be cooked. We'll see if that works. Push this in. Alright, here we go. Put the tape on the bottom here and everything. Alright, so the fan's gonna work now. I might have to adjust the gas valve down because uh seals kind of high outside there. See it? I lowered the gas pressure down a little bit. See, it was too high before. Just by lowering the gas pressure makes a big difference. See it? I had to tweak the had to tweak the um, the gas valve down a little bit. So I cleaned the flame sensor. 
new 10 cap for the fan cap. Michael Farad, he's turning it down now the way he wants it. Uh, we set the gas valve because the combustion test wasn't passing, so we set lower the gas valve, and now the combustion test passed. But it needed a it needed a um, fan cap, and the flame sensor needed to be cleaned. It's a Goodman. Yeah. Well, you got it on forty. That's on forty. You want it on seventy, right? Yes. Well, 68, something like that. What do you want, 68? Yeah, it'd be nice, 68. 68? That's nice. Okay. And the fan one's going automatic. And it's on heat. If you put it on fan on, the fan will run all the time. So fan automatic. It's 78 in here, which is... So it's set for 68, okay? That's good. And it's on hold. So that's what okay. we want. Thank you very much. Oh.